The excitement for soccer continues to soar around the world and also right here in Central Florida. Maddie McDaniel and I took a closer look at the Village's SC and its 12th Buffalo supporters. Pickleball, rec centers, town squares, and golf carts. Those are usually the words that come to mind when thinking about the Villages. But sooner rather than later, the word soccer just might be added to that list as the Villages SC explodes with enthusiasm and support both on the field and off. Only a few months ago, the Villages was awarded a Premier Development League team and within the first four PDL games, the team has a record of two and two. Two of those games were won with last minute goals, both of which were scored by midfielder Pedro Diaz. And those games, it's just, just gotta be like focus on the game and then wait until the last minute because like in soccer, you never know what's gonna happen. I think the, the strength is uh, we're, we're keeping the ball on the ground. Uh, everybody's playing as a team. Uh, our defense is doing a really good job, our goalkeeper. I think we need, just need to get, get a little bit better uh, scoring goals and now, you know, now waiting for the last uh, minute. For me, it's, it's the best win. You know, you work hard, work hard the entire game, and then you have that win. It's, it, I think it has a, a, a special taste, but we, we have to take the, 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 the early chances uh, on the game and, 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 and score. Although the team has only been around for a few months, the guys have bonded fiercely, all the more surprising since they're from countries as far as South America and Europe. First of all, the, the better thing is uh, most of us we live together every single day, so we like we uh, uh, we have like a breakfast together, lunch together, dinner together. So we talk a lot about everything, and I think it has been helping us, you know, to help each other in the field. For example, me, I'm from Brazil, and I'm so far away from home. So I think when I mean you see your teammates like as siblings, brothers, you know, like a family, a relatives. But it's not just the team that's been developing a strong rapport in short time. The attendees have been coming in mass droves to show their support. Although there's only been four games so far, the team already has a big fan base known as the 12th Buffalo. It's awesome, like we have like this fans in the section and they, they're here to support and to support the team in the city. And I think it's really important for us to show up on the games and make the, the effort for them and bring the victory that they, they all want to see. And it's an extra a boost for us. Uh, the players def definitely appreciate, uh, especially when we're playing a, in a heat like this and, and they're getting tired, they need that extra motivation to keep running. These seats won't be empty for long. The Village's SC draws quite the crowd. This growing crowd includes village residents showing their love and support. The 12th Buffalo is a dedicated group that gathers together to cheer on the team. The 12th Buffalo is a supporter group for the Village's Soccer Club. Uh, we are considered a community organization. We just started. Stacy and I were talking about it at work one day uh, over coffee and we got this new PDL team here and we wanted to have something for the community. It's something that's going to be all inclusive for the people that live here, the residents of the villages, the high schoolers, the fans, friends, family, everybody. Whoever wants to be part of this can be part of this. The community reaction has been great. It was small when we first started and it is booming. Every match we get more and more fans here, we get more and more people supporting us at the 12th Buffalo, wanting to ask us questions. Uh, where we work at Shoebiz, we sell tickets and the apparel for the Villages SC. So. Everyone comes and asks us questions there also, so the fan reaction is great all around. We get to see it on every end. And since we launched the Facebook page back in May, um, we've had you know, good success with it. There's been a lot of people interacting with it, so it's been pretty cool. And we end up, we're gonna plan on having some products coming soon, like shirts and hats and scarves and stuff. They can reach us at Facebook, at the 12th Buffalo Facebook page. We're also on Twitter. It's the 12th Buffalo, it's at the 12th Buffalo SG on Twitter and we're also on Instagram and any one of those they can reach out to us. Um, it's not membership based right now but we would like for that to you know become in the future. Um, but yeah just anyone that wants to support the team and come out and have a great time. For more information on the 12th Buffalo visit their website at www.thevillagessc.com or call 516-8239. With this look at the Villages SC and the 12th Buffalo, I'm Maddie McDaniel.